All right, here we go. We are back to Black. Black Ops 3, that is. And, you know, a lot of talk has been going on with this whole holiday community challenge. And, <laughs> like, 50-something million matches had to be completed in order for us to unlock, you know, these supply drops with the ranged and melee weapons. So, you know, honestly, I, I really didn't participate in this because, uh... I haven't been playing a whole lot of video games, to be honest. And uh, whenever I do hop on, I am mainly... I played a few games here and there of World War II. Got bored of that. And more, more actually, I got frustrated more than just got bored of it, uh, to be honest. But uh, I've been playing just other games when I've been getting on more than Call of Duty. So I really didn't have a lot to contribute, but I will partake in... The, uh, the fruits of everybody's labor. So uh, thank you for those of you guys who contributed to the 50 million matches in order for us to unlock uh, the goodies. And what you're watching is the fruits of that supply drop for the ranged weapon is the R70 Ajax LMG. And this is a weapon. What's so special about this weapon is the fact that it reloads by itself. So as you guys can tell, I don't have to reload. Um, it just automatically regenerates its um, its ammunition, which is pretty pretty cool. Uh, I will admit that it's pretty cool. The weapon itself, though, I will say, is not the greatest weapon out there. I feel like there are a lot of other ranged weapons that are a lot better than this. I think that the damage in this uh, weapon is not that great. I feel like it doesn't drop people that quick as other weapons probably would uh, one of the things with this weapon is it's not very agile it's not very mobile you know there are other weapons some machine guns and even assault rifles that are a lot better than this weapon the only redeeming factor is the fact that you don't have to reload so it regenerates its ammunition so you don't have to worry about that which is the coolest part about this weapon um, you know, one of the things that I noticed right away while using this weapon was the fact that its uh, recoil is pretty crazy. So, you know, you have to manage that with suppressor and grip. And that's exactly what I have on this weapon as far as trying to control, you know, the recoil here. And I also have a reflex sight. So even then, it, it, does, have, it does have a subtle, you know, recoil that kind of throws it off a little bit. It's not super accurate, but at the same time, if you have those attachments, oh my god, the lag, look at that lag, insane. Um, even with those attachments, the the recoil is there slightly, but it is a little bit more manageable when you have those things on. But I feel like that kind of takes away from all the attachments that you really want to put on this weapon. Um, like I really wanted to put on quick draw, but I couldn't do it because I wanted to keep Especially with the perks that I wanted to play with, I wasn't gonna compromise, you know, using what I really wanted to. Um, for as far as just subtle advantages that I normally have on my weapons, like quick draw, that way I get the aim up quick, um, faster than my opponents, stuff like that. That's mainly what I play with. But you know what? It it's all right. You know, I I, I think it definitely comes down to what maps you're playing on because from far away. If you kind of head glitch a little bit with this weapon, I think you'll do well. I think you have to pay, uh, play at a pace that is kind of slowed down, not so much like run and gun, like up in their face and in their spawn kind of deal. Because uh, I feel like you, you won't be able to turn really quickly and you know adjust to situations where you know enemies are coming at you from all different directions. So I feel like this is definitely a weapon where you're gonna have to play a little more conservative and exactly like I'm doing right here. You see how I'm just kind of camping, head glitching a little bit and waiting for them to pop up on my screen more than me just rushing into their base. See, as I try to rush in, that's exactly what happens. I get taken out, not very good. So um, I think like there are other weapons that I think are better than the Ajax to be honest, but it's an all right weapon. I mean, I wouldn't say it's my favorite weapon. I wouldn't say it's the best weapon at all, but uh, it's an okay weapon. Uh, I kind of wish I'd gotten some other ranged weapon 
to be honest, but you know what? It is what it is. Um, so yeah, with that being said, the new year is upon us for those of us who have already stepped into the future um, that are ahead of me anyways. Here in another part of the world, I live in California. So tomorrow will be the new year for me, for those of you guys who already uh, have stepped into the future of 2018. Happy New Year to you guys. And for those of us who will be heading into the new year um, tomorrow, Happy New Year in advance to you and your family as well. I hope you guys stay safe, have a great one, and have a good time, man. It's it's uh, It's been a crazy year, 2017. It's been a busy year for me, uh, to be honest. I've just been all over the place as far as school goes. Got a new job as well. So a lot of new things have been going on and uh, a lot of stuff that I'm looking forward to. As far as the grind goes, I haven't been uploading a lot on YouTube because honestly, I just haven't had the time, man. I've, I've had to prioritize some things in my life and it's a point in time where I kind of have to grind right now. I have to set my roots and you know focus on the things that will set me up for uh, greater things to come in the future, definitely. When it, when it comes to things that will set you up for a great future, you have to put in the work now in order to reap the benefits um, later on. So for those of you guys who are looking to grind in the new year, want to make subtle changes, want to make big changes, go for it, man. Now's the time. Don't let it drag on. Don't let it wait till the next year or the following year. Just get it done now. That way you're going to be able to reap the benefits and, you know, just enjoy the future and what it holds for you. So with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate those of you guys who support the channel. And with that being said, Happy New Year, and this is GCP, and I am signing off.